guys, I am Wizarding World YouTuber Victoria McLean and welcome back to my channel. Now today I feel like I've got something really heavy in my hand. It's Mano Moody's wand, it's massive. Um, today I have a box from, I think it's pronounced A2V and it's like craft items, Harry Potter craft items. So I have had this box for a little while um, and I'm really sorry that I haven't been able to do it until now. As you know my schedule has been absolutely insane but I love the idea of this for Christmas ideas. So this is a kind of ideas for Christmas video even though I haven't done my Christmas decorations yet. Ah, I will be doing them as soon as I'm allowed to. Well I, I could do them if I wanted to, it's just can I be asked to go up in the attic on my own without any help from anybody else. No. So today I am using my, for some reason, my Mad Eye Moody staff wand. I say staff wand because it's even though it's a wand, it's like a bloody staff. It's so big! But it's it's like one of the most heaviest, chunkiest wands I think have ever been created. But it matches his staff as well, doesn't it, that I actually have in that corner. It is just humongous. But before I knock myself out with it, I'm going to put it back before I break it. So as I said, I have a lovely box of items here and I'm going to get straight into it. I don't want to go too kind of into the box and I'm worried that I'm going to damage whatever is inside. So I've now opened the box. So I get rid of the labels. Okay, so there we have the box and I'm going to open it now. So we have a lovely parcel of bits and bobs inside and we have a card that says hello in green with green ribbon so let's have a look at what it says inside the card ah to victoria we hope you love using these products for your next magical creation remember to share your designs on uh, your instagram and tag a the a2v brands packed by Gemma from the shelf team so thank you ever so much Gemma for packing my lovely items I think this is going to be a thing where I literally just kind of go a bit stupid with ideas and start thinking about all the things I want to make so they have included some fabric which I know that people normally go for go crazy for are they called like swatches or something I can't quite remember what do you call them so we've got a beautiful piece of fabric here with all the crests on so how lovely is that that's stunning now all these items are officially licensed i'm going to put that to one side otherwise i'm going to just damage it or my cat will do something do you know what right do you know what right not only have i got a gap in my pin section because she keeps attacking my pins on my pin shelf but do you remember those lovely little blackbirds i had on my halloween decorations yeah she's eaten all of them except one and i say eaten she's taken off all the feathers all the feathers okay i am just we found dead birds fake dead birds everywhere she threw up once was not impressed with that because it was in my room um but yeah we've have moved them but my goodness it was a mess so i have now got patches on my shelves and um i have no fake birds left other than one i like the ribbon that they included very 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 slitheron so let's open this parcel so we have a couple of parcels wrapped up in lovely green ribbon so this first one's open so i'm going to close it again and we're going to take off the packaging oh look at that it's a make your own harry potter that that's so good i love crocheting this is crocheting isn't it crochet kit i love crocheting my mum got me into crocheting when i was little and then when she passed away she was starting a blanket and i finished the blanket and turned it into a king size blanket it's huge and all multi-colored and so i love crocheting so i'd love to give something like this a go because i'm, I'm my brain is so kind of crazy that i feel like doing something like this would really help um so this is really nice so it's uh, collect the set Dobby Hedwig and is also available apparently so this contains the tarn the yarn sorry tarn the yarn the crochet hook the dar darning needle darning needle the stuffing and the instructions so we have this fantastic new kit here so make me so we have as she said we've got the stuffing we've got all the little bits of yarn we do have the instructions, very important, obviously, obviously. And we have 
oh hang on the crochet needle is stuck and we have a little gold number this is 3.0 millimeters crochet needle so that's brilliant i love that idea i love the idea of crocheting something again i've still got my two bags of crochet stuff behind the sofa that it's probably either full of spiders or full of dust right now but i really like it i feel like an old lady doing it but i wasn't i was only like 29 i think when i started um, and obviously did it when I was really really young so and then obviously continued after mum passed away so that I really enjoy it so I'm going to pop that down because I actually have another one in here so we have another package all wrapped up in green so I'm going to open it I might actually have to cut this because it's very very tightly oh no 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 the ribbon is coming undone if I can save ribbons I always try because I love ribbons so we have more green ribbon and I'm going to show you without showing myself so there we are oh what's that is that a cushion oh wow knitted cushion cover kit do you know what i've got to be honest our cushions are really looking sorry for themselves not the ones i've had from companies because they are still going but like primark ones i had for years they like the zips have gone or they're covered in stains from either the kids or the cats or they've been pulled by claws so oh well look at that knitted cushion cover kit wow try saying that 10 times fast skill level two make me make me um and so inside it says knitted kit fits a 30 to 30 centimeter cushion pad it comes with the yarn knitting needles door dawning needle and instructions i hope so because i when was the last time i knitted oh my life and i we lived at home that's how long it's been since I've knitted. My next door neighbour would knit loads. And so I would literally go next door because I was a proper old fashioned girl. I was. I loved creating stuff. Um, and I would learn how to knit through my neighbour Dillis. And it was a bit crazy. So, uh, oh, I like the colours. So we've got the greens. We've got the white. We have the yellow, obviously, for Hufflepuff. Green for Slytherin. We have the blue for, obviously, my house. And we have the... Um, it's like a pinky red isn't it for for, uh, for Gryffindor we have the all important instructions and um, we have the knitting needles and we have the black thread and there's a needle taped to the top of the box so how cool is that I love these I'm not sure when I'm going to get time to do them because if I'm not doing uni I'm working if I'm not working I'm doing uni if I'm not doing uni or working I'm doing stuff for the kitchen or the house or the kids but I tell you something I would really love to give these a go I even got one of those diamond art kits um, I got a massive one sent to me by the company who creates them I still haven't had a chance to do it yet you know it's just I, I just say to them about sending because they, they messaged me about doing a few other items and I said oh it'd be great you know send me a few items but then I don't don't know when I'll get a chance to do them but things like this I can put you know the the, the diamond, diamond art is a bit different because it's like a huge thing or you can get a smaller one um, and you you know you've got to find someone to put it you've got to find someone to do it with things like this I just put them in a little like bag like um, a tote bag or something and just pop them by the side of my bed or um, by the side of the sofa or wherever you know I think it's a great idea so thank you so much for sending me these these are really really adorable and for anybody who's creative um what level is this right this says this is three so that's difficult so this is a level two um what ages are they let's have a look for 14 plus so they're both 14 plus so anyone who you know is a harry potter fan who likes getting creative then these are such a brilliant christmas idea what a brilliant stocking filler I love them and they have so many items in their collection so definitely definitely have a look at them I will put the links down below for you um but yeah I think that's really great I love the pillow I, I mean I can't say it would definitely come out like that but and Harry's certainly going to come out like that but I would love to give it a try I think he's just adorable so there was me thinking you have to fill kind of like the crochet bit but you don't so it's not like that it's um that it's filled with stuffing so yeah I think the cushion looks easier according to this and then Harry looks a bit more difficult but I'd make everything I'd make like the kids uh, when I was pregnant Monica I'd make a little booties and little hat and everything out of crochet um I loved it I loved making stuff and I just did it I wasn't shown I was shown how to start because I, I could never figure out how to start the little 
bit at the beginning I never re realized I mean I, I know now and um, the back that I really struggled but as long as my mum started me off I could make anything and I did I made loads of things I just got carried away and just loved every second of it it was it was brilliant but uh I love being creative I just I'm not sure when I have time I'm really hoping because I don't I'm not going back to once I finish uni on the 15th of this of, of next month I'm not back now until the beginning of February so January is already a quiet month isn't it so with a bit of luck I will be able to get more done and get some little things like this done and maybe finish doing this room because it's a tip. Uh, it's absolute mess. But let me know what you thought of these lovely items. Until next time, take care. I love you all and I'll speak to you very, very soon. My content take a look at this video right here or this video right here don't forget to like and subscribe